everyone, this is Sue from Innkeeper's Journal. I have a few journals ready I would like to show to you. There's uh, four different styles. They have a wallpaper, a vintage wallpaper cover, and an image, and some fabric sewn on, and a little bit of bling and lace, and a uh, ribbon closure with this little. Mother of Pearl closure. I will, I will go through this one first. I'm going to try to get all four of them in on the uh, on this one video. So it just opens up like this. Just has the, it's fastened on one end and it's just free. So it's the cover. It has a fabric lining and then just a, a real clear pocket. And this is a, an embossed painted book page, place to write. And this just has a embellished piece of, well, it's a cut off from the pages. Um, this is a, some of my leftover printable tea pages, the tea journal in my Etsy store. It's a kit. Uh, there's some fabric and this little tuck spot. This is a butterfly journal card. It's like a Franken page with some sewing. An embellished page with a napkin and some fabric. And this just opens up, place to write. And this is just a little piece tucked under here. Tuck spot printed on the page of the tuck spot. Just flips out. This is like a pocket. You can tuck things behind the pocket or in the clear pocket. Some muslin on the side. Kind of stuck together. This is an owl printed on the page. Some leaves. And it's like a belly band, place to write. Coffee filter with some fabric. Aged pages. This is a tuck spot. Little angel. This is just another tuck spot, place to write, has sewing around the edges. This is a bag, an old book page pocket, and a butterfly journal card. And that just tucks in the bag and sits on the bag like that. Fabric on the edge. There's an old calendar page with tuck spots. This also flips open. This is one of my printables in my store. A little tab that's also printable in my store. A little tuck spot flips open, place to write some embellished with lace. It just says one signature. These are tuck spots and places to write. Music paper. So this side of the bag. It's a little journal card with some little tab fabric tab. This is an envelope, has an owl. It's embossed too. I think it just kind of sits on this page like this. It's an owl printed page. It's a fabric pocket with a journal card tucked inside. Butterflies. A little fabric, a little girl printed on there. Another Franken page with scraps of paper. This is a tuck spot with some stamping. And this is another clear journal spot on the on the fabric. That's the fabric on the page. And then that's the back. So to close them, I just it like that. So they're just uh, simple one signature journals. So I'll go through the other ones. They're all pretty similar. Go through kind of quickly. This one has the uh, cats and lace and fabric sewed on. 
another fabric lining, birds and an acrylic pocket. This is just a old receipt page with some lace. This is another couple of scraps of paper hanging on this graph paper. This another page from the T printable. This is this uh, little journal card. It has a pocket here so you can tuck things in the pocket. And it has a ribbon pocket, fabric tab. Lots of color. This has some ribbon woven in the slots on the page. Pages are aged. Lace. This is a little fabric ticket and a little journal spot. Some flowers, like lace flowers. This is another journal card tucked in here. It's the double pockets. This is an old book page. Calendar page. There's a little ticket tucked in there. This is a fabric bird on a teapot. It's another book page. Designer paper, aged paper, coffee filter. It's just some fabric on the ticket. What I did on some of these tickets, sometimes when I print things off, they don't um, print real, real well if you're running out of ink or something. And so I just put some fabric over the top and sewed around the edges and you know, you can stamp on there, or I didn't do a lot of stamping in these. I thought sometimes people want to do their own stamping. And this is a pocket here. This is another cut off of a designer paper page. Goes in that fabric pocket. Um, gardening book page pocket. Butterfly page. This is an old photograph. It's a vintage photo. I just sewed around the edges. Sometimes when they're really old, they like to curl up. So when I sew it around the edges, it kind of keeps it from curling up. So I kind of like that. Lays flat. It's another one of my tabs with fabric and lace in the pocket. It's an old, uh, this is an old authentic uh, original postcard. I'm not sure what the year is. Got a little message written on there. And a stamp. Coffee filter. Tuck spot. The other side of the old book page. There's a pocket here. Made it from scraps. So, this is hanging on this belly band, a little piece of fabric, scrap. You know, if you want to make tabs or something that match in your journal. The other dress journal card. Another journal spot. Ticket in there. Another cluster pocket. And another acrylic pocket in the back. So that's the second one, and that has the cats on the front. I will um, list the journal, link the journals down below the video. And someone also mentioned sometimes when they're on their cell phone they can't get to the link. So I'll I'll try to link my Etsy store on on the video someplace. And then if you want to just go to the journal section in the Etsy store, the journals will be listed in there. So this is the third one. It's kind of a pink oval. Same thing, has some fabric scraps and some bling, lace on the edge, sewn around the edges, and fabric lined. And this is a little belly band on here with the fabric ribbon, uh, ribbon and buttons. And that goes in there. Um, this is like a guest check, guest check tuck spot. Or this is a little tuck spot here. This is another one of the dress journal cards. This is a snippet tuck spot or band on the page. This is another one of the large journal cards. It's got birds and kind of pretty. I always like to age everything so it's not real stark white. 
This flips open. This is a place to write. It's also a tuck spot for this little journal card here. Place to write up here. Another belly band with yellow ribbon. Sheet music. Fabric pocket. Tuck spots on this pocket. I like this paper. It's from an old book. This is the butterfly page. Another tuck spot. Pretty fabrics in here. This is another old vintage photo. Sewn around the edges. Goes in that fabric pocket. So you can really kind of take the journal and add a lot of your own stamping or embellishing. Just wanted to make some simple journals up. This is another old vintage postcard. 1947. Another one here. This one's kind of a black and white, but I thought they're neat. They have, you know, writing on the back and, a, and a, an old stamp. Goes in those pockets. It's a book magazine page with some pockets on it. Some more lace. Lots of tuck spots, places to put things that you collect. This is just another piece of the cut-off paper. Another vintage postcard. There's some vintage papers. This is a large journal card. Some fabric. Another tuck spot. And this is the back with the transparency pocket on the fabric. Okay, so that is the third journal. And then I'll get the I'll get the last journal. And this is the paper on this is they're all vintage wallpaper. With fabric and bling and lace on the side and vintage fabric inside. Another journal spot with the, the tuck spot band. Another the teapot printable. Just a couple different tuck spots in here. It's a little tea card in this pocket. Another large journaling spot. Another large journal card. This is a fabric page sewing around the edge. Paper backed. This has a the envelope, the recipe card inside. It says this kind of cut off from there, just like a almost like a seal on the envelope. This is sewing around the edges. It's a little coffee filter la lace flower pocket with a little journal card in there. This is the printable paper. Angels and girls printed on there. Some old paper, Franken pages, tuck spots, clusters of fabric, embellished receipt page with some lace and some bling, book pages. It's another bag embellished with some abandoned fabric. It's another little journal card in here, fabric pocket. The other side of the bag has some more fabric. A little bit of fabric glued on there. It's a little Eiffel Tower. This flips open. There's a little bling on here. Another Franken page made out of scraps. Some printing on those pages. Another other side of that printed page. Another printed page on the fabric page. This is a this scrap hangs on this belly band. A little tuck spot with a pink receipt. And a pocket here. Another pocket here. A little trim of fabric or paper on there. And then another journaling spot in the transparency pocket. So that is the fourth journal. Like I said, those will be listed in my Etsy store, so you can go over and check those out. Pick out which one you like. They're, the 
which is a nice size. They have a lot of room to expand if you fill them up with the thing, your favorite things. And um, right, thank you for watching. Bye now. <laughs>